One of the major new features of Onsong 2022, which is support for the Mac. And we're not just talking about the M1 and iPad emulation, we're talking about a full native version of Onsong that's now available on the Mac. So let's come and take a look. So over here, we have Onsong running on the Mac. Uh, you can download this from the App Store, the Mac App Store, and it works pretty much just like you'd expect Onsong to work. Uh, one of the nice things is you can obviously change the size of that window to whatever you want. And things look a little bit different because it is a little bit more Mac-like. For instance, to scroll down through our list, we use two-finger swipe on our trackpad. Or if we wanted to delete something, same thing, we can use that two-finger swipe. Some other really cool features is that we now have a full menu bar. So for instance, if I wanted to import something from my Mac, I could just hit the import button here. And that's gonna give me my import dialog, which I can view my downloads, my desktop, whatever. I also have a number of other options. One of those is I can enter, main, enter full screen. So if I wanted to just take over, just like you might wanna use Onsong this way, I can hide my menu bar to really make use of that. And again, to work through my song, I could either tap on the screen to scroll up and down, or I can use two finger swipe on my trackpad. Another menu that we have is window. So for instance, right now we're looking at our main window, which is our on song chord chart. But if we wanted to, we could tap on lyrics projection here, and that's gonna open up my lyrics projection screen. And I can drag that to another, uh, another desktop, another screen that I might have connected. And of course I can come in here and make all those changes. You can see it's making that change live behind the scenes right here. I can drag that to where I want and then I can go full screen with it just by tapping. Let's come out of full screen mode there. And I can run stage monitor mode at the same time just by tapping on stage monitor mode. And again, I can take that stage monitor and move that to another monitor that I have and go full screen. And the great thing is, is that the Mac version will remember what I had on what screen and if it were full screen or not. So super powerful there. And I can also share right from the menu as well.